Hi guys, it's Yvonne. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a minute since I have been filming. Anyway, I just wanted to do a little get ready with me and explain kind of like where I am in life right now. So first thing I want to talk about is that I'm moving. <laughs> So I live in Miami right now. I worked at a high school this past year. It was a great experience, but it ended. So and it was like a one year type of job. And also my hair is in rollers, so sorry about that. Um, it was a one year job with the AmeriCorps City Year. Basically with that organization, they give you scholarships for grad school. Long story short, I am going to grad school at University of Cincinnati this fall. So I'm moving back to Cincinnati, and Cincinnati is where I'm from. And I'm going to be moving back home, which really stinks because I love having my own place. But I just know it's the smartest move I can make because I don't really know my like job situation yet. I'm going to be working at um, Hope Bridge, my old job. And I'm also going to be a cycle instructor. I'm a cycle instructor at Cycle Bar. So I'm gonna be moving to Cincinnati um, and working there. But like also, I don't know how much I can juggle with school. So like we're just gonna like slowly figure that out as we go. And yeah, it would just be too stressful to find an apartment right now. So I'm just moving back home. I'm really excited to move back to Cincinnati. I love Cincinnati, so I'm like so excited to be moving back. It just feels like a home for me. foundation that I have been using is the liquid powder foundation mattifying oil free by hourglass it was on sale at Sephora for like 30 bucks which is like still expensive as so I don't know how much the real price is and it's also super tiny so like I feel like I would not spend more than 30 for that but um whatever so right now I'm just in the process of selling all my furniture. The furniture in my bedroom, like in here, I'm gonna take home with me because I'm moving into my older brother's room, which is like a bigger room. And I'm gonna bring all this furniture there. But all the furniture in the living room, I've been trying to sell on a Facebook marketplace. I sold like a little vase plant today and it fell over and it broke, but she still bought it. I gave it to her for $10 instead of the full price because it like low key broke. But I was like, you can just put this side to the wall. No one will see it. She was like, okay. So I'm doing some bronzer. This is Danessa, bro, I don't even know. So this is my second to last weekend here. So me and a couple friends are gonna go out, to hit the town. Next weekend is Rolling Loud. So me and my little brother, Brady, my younger brother, he's not little. My younger brother, Brady, and then my boyfriend, Joey. We're gonna go to Rolling Loud. And so that is Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And then Monday, we are driving 15 hours back to Cincinnati. And I am going to try and vlog. I feel like that'd be a good vlog. Not just for you guys, for the viewers out there, whoever is watching this, friends, family, if you're a random person, thank you for watching. Um, anyway, but no, I just feel like if I vlog next weekend, that would just be a good memory just for me also Because it's like my last weekend here and like it's gonna be so I don't think it's like been hitting me really yet I'm not gonna be here Because like I don't know no beach, you know, that's gonna be like ugh. It's gonna be a huge difference to be honest I'm always gonna be coming back, so don't you worry. They're just going to be some more Miami vlogs in the future. Now I'm just blending this out with a little blending brush. It's like so hard to do your makeup when you have like your hair going on. But yeah, and then on um, Monday morning, the day that we leave, we're gonna wake up early at like six or like 5.30. We're gonna go watch the sunrise on the beach and make our way back to Cincinnati. That's gonna be like the ending like of an era, like by the ocean and like letting it go. I just like feel like there'd be a vibe. It's like so peaceful and like it's so pretty. I did it one time before and I just wanna do it again. Just to end this era, say goodbye to Miami, Florida, go back to Ohio. And some people like might not understand why I am moving, like why I'm so excited to go back feels like such home for me and my entire family is there. 
I love it so much. I went to high school, you know, I like growing up, I never really liked Ohio or Cincinnati. And I always wanted to move away when I was younger. So that's also like a part of the reason I did this experience because I've always wanted to and like you never know if you don't try. And I didn't know if I was gonna stay here or if I was gonna move back. <laughs> but like living here made me realize like family means so much to me. I'm really lucky that I have a really awesome family. Not just my like mom and like my brothers, but like my cousins, my aunts and uncles. Just I'm really lucky to have them. Like, honestly, like the party lifestyle here isn't really for me because I went through that phase in college. I mean, it's still super fun. It's still really cool to like go to all the cool places they have here in Miami and dinner and stuff like that, I don't know. My priorities just have changed so much and I'm ready to go home, be with my boyfriend, be with my family, go back to school and like finally start my life. This, this is just how I feel, but it's like the longer that I'm here, the more that I'm putting my life on hold low key. I don't know why I feel like that's what I just do. People don't understand, but at the end of the day, it's your life. Whatever makes you happy is what you have to do. And you can never compare yourself to other people's lives. It's very bittersweet to leave this place, that's for sure. And like, I'm honestly not trying to even think about it because I don't really want to get sad. Not really sad because I know I'm going to always be coming back here because I have a ton of friends here. Literally one of my like closest friends from high school is from here. Like lives here now. So I think I'm going to be here. Love Miami. This was a great experience. It's just not for me long term. I guess I can talk about uh, my cycle bar journey. So yes, I became an instructor in April. And since April, most, yeah, pretty much from like May, to now I've been subbing at the cycle bar here at Ventura because like there's been a ton of instructors who go out of town who got sick literally I've been subbing like every other day for the past two months at least it's been super fun I'm really excited to become a part of the Kenwood locations um, instructor base so I'm excited about that I don't know I just life My favorite bar here, bar slash restaurant, is Monty's Grill. It's like right on the pier where all the boats are docked. It's so cool. It's such like a beach town vibe. And it's very fun. Food's very good. Also, I've been there like 20 times. Also, where else? Moxie's and Brickle is really nice, really good. Sugar, the rooftop. And then you got Rose Sky, Sexy Fish is my favorite restaurant in Miami. That's for sure. It's also in Brickell. Me and my boyfriend go there all the time whenever he's in town. We've been there like four times. We're gonna go again this last time. Cause he's coming in. I don't know if I, yeah, I said this. But um, yeah, they're coming in on Friday. We're like, wow, it is this weekend. And then we're gonna go to Sexy Fish on like Sunday or Saturday or something. My favorite part about being an instructor is finding all this new music that I listen to. If you know me, you know that I'm obsessed with Ariana Grande, so I'm going through this phase. Each class has to have one Ariana Grande song. I told one of the members that we're like friends, and I was like, yeah, my thing, my goal is to have one Ariana Grande song per class, and she was like, I've noticed. I was like, oh gosh, that's so funny. So I didn't end up showing you guys the rest of my finished makeup, but you'll see it in the rest of the video. I did a little vlog of the rest of this day. Really fun, really great memory, so enjoy watching it. Thank you guys for watching. saw this really cute puppy in the window of a store so we had to go in and pet it. It was so cute, so fun. Oh my god, I loved it. This is 
my friend's balcony. So I sort of was a good vlogger tonight, I feel like. We went to this little day party pool type of thing. That was really fun. I just had a good time with a few of my girlfriends and now we're back here. We took a little moment to chill out. We went to Trader Joe's, we got a few snacks right around the corner. Now I'm bringing some wine. My friend is getting ready right now. I just wanted to show you this beautiful view. This is insane. Oh my gosh. Like literally, look at this. Let's go. 